Hi, I'm doing a quick check-in video about uh, people we meet on vacation. So I guess you can call this a uh, reading vlog slash update, whatever the case may be. I've been reading People We Meet on Vacation by Emily Henry, and I'm now at the 46% mark. And I have to say, I have some thoughts. So I will say that I really like uh, Emily Henry's uh, writing style. Really witty, really uh, sharp dialogue that I've enjoyed. But I found that it starts off really slow, in my opinion. But one of the things that I kind of appreciate narratively is that there's just a gradual building of tension between uh, Poppy and Alex. So the basic premise is that Alex and Poppy are going on a road trip together. Uh, Poppy has been kind of feeling, I guess, some existential crisis about her job as a travel blogger, journalist, and just about life in general. And she just has kind of lost her passion and excitement and zest for life. And she's kind of pinpointed part of the reason why is that she's no longer Ha she no longer has this friendship with Alex. They were really good friends. They met in college and they did a lot of road trips slash vacations together. And even though their personalities are polar opposites of one another, somehow they just really gelled and clicked as friends. And then there was some big fight or blow up that happens and they haven't really spoken to each other in over two years. So they end up reconnecting and Poppy decides to invite Alex onto a trip and kind of to help them reconnect. And it just so happens that Alex has a wedding to go to, which is, uh, I think, his younger brother, his youngest brother's wedding. So throughout the story, you kind of get flashbacks to what their friendship used to be like. And there's this gradual building of tension, like Poppy will make these kind of remarks and she means them in a joking manner, but you can tell that Alex is kind of taking them as personal digs because he's very straight laced, very deadpan in his humor and he's anxious and he's really someone that's really structural in routine. And Poppy's a little bit more fly off the seat of her pants, more exuberant, more boisterous. But they really work well together. But there's these little digs that she'll make, which you can tell narratively they're not supposed to be mean-spirited or to cause any malice. But you can see how Alex kind of interprets it as little digs on him. And she'll kind of make comments about their their hometown in Ohio that they grew up in and it's mainly because in her backstory uh Poppy's backstory she was bullied quite a bit in school so she does have some resentment towards her old stomping grounds whereas Alex really enjoys that small town life so these little digs and comments you kind of see kind of building and building and you can see that things will come to a head so I'm at the point where it's at the 46% where things have kind of come to a head and they're kind of letting it all hash out. And this is the part that I've been waiting for. So I felt like it's been narratively a little bit slow, but now we're kind of at the point where there's obviously this sexual tension. There's this undercurrent in this relationship. And now the kind of the cards are being laid out on the table and it's really interesting kind of chemistry. You know, I'm someone that likes enemies to lovers, but so very rarely is that ever really well executed. Um, I, I like friends to lovers as well, but it just really depends on how it's done. This is a really interesting kind of friends to lovers dynamic. And you... You, you just kind of want to smash their skulls together and say, come on, guys, like, how are you not seeing that you guys are crazy for each other? So I'm actually really enjoying it. So I'm at 46%.
kind of wish there's a little bit more diversity in this, but that's another conversation for another day. But I am liking people we meet on vacation, and depending on how it plays out, I think I actually might pick up Beach Read, which I know had really amazing reviews. So that's kind of my thoughts right now for people we meet on vacation. Probably be done soon, and I'll post a final review and my final thoughts. So hopefully the second half comes in really strong. Until then, have an amazing night. Peace.